transfer one which converts to 30 volts AC to 12 0 12 volts AC and from that uh, it, it is given to a pa uh, the 12 0 12 volts power supply input is given to a pa power supply circuit and by using a diode bridge rectifier uh, and capacitors uh, to, to eliminate the ripples. Capacitors are used to eliminate the ripples by using the uh, diode bridge rectifier this AC 12 volts is converted to 5 volts uh, DC output and uh, uh, that output is given uh, to uh, ICs LM324N uh, to the fourth pin. Five volts is given to the fourth pin, and uh, ground ground and eleventh pin is grounded. Eleventh pin of LM324 is grounded, and then uh, the uh, piezoelectric sensor is uh, input uh, output of the piezoelectric sensor is given uh, is given to the two uh, two and three pins of the LM324, and after that uh, the Output amplified output. This is used to amplify the uh, output of the piezoelectric sensor. The amplified output uh, is given to DAC, and through DAC it is given to the computer. Now, if we uh, if if that piezoelectric sensor is placed on a motor, then uh, there will be a variation in the signals. If it act on this, there will be a variation in signal like that. So uh, this is the variation, this is due to the uh, change in vibration, uh, piezoelectric sensor uh, senses the uh, vibrations on the MFP and will get the output uh, to do that. By analyzing these signals uh, uh, in lab view, we can, um, we can uh, state the health of the machine.